So a lot of people ask me, how do I find the vertex of something like this? Well, it's easy. I mean, your calculator can do it all for you. Just hit y equals 2. And notice, I put my, my uh, equation, my quadratic equation in there. Okay, so now I'm just going to hit graph. Boom. There it is. On Zoom Standard, everything's fine. But what is that vertex? Well, we got to notice something about the vertex. The vertex is the lowest point. That lowest point meaning that this is, in fact, a minimum. Well, check this out. Hit second, hit calc, and you can find the minimum. The minimum is number three. Boom. Now, it asks you some weird questions. It asks you, what's the left bound? What's the right bound? Simple. All this means is you want to go left of where the vertex is. Here's the vertex right here right there. You want to go on the left side of it. That's what left bound means. Hit enter. Then it's going to ask you, find me the right bound. So it helps the calculator zoom in on what you're trying to find. So just go to the right side. There it is. Hit enter. Then it's going to say guess. Well, yeah, of course you want it to guess. Punch it. And look at this. You get minus 1.4999. Okay, which is kind of gross, but you got to realize what does minus 1.4999999 mean? This is your calculator rounding. You're actually at minus 1.5. So how do I fi figure that out? Real simple. Hit clear, right? Hit X, hit equals 2, and there's minus 1.4999976 and so on. This is the calculator ra rounding. All you have to use is minus 1.5. Great. Convert that into a fraction. Hit math, hit enter, but boom. Now you got minus three over two. There's your actual X value for your vertex in nice, pretty fractional form. Well, how about Y? Y is found real simple because if you look at the screen, there's really no Y here, but yes, there is right down there. There's the Y. How do you get to it? Hit alpha one. There's your Y. Hit enter. Do you remember the number? I didn't until I hit alpha enter. There's minus 7.25. And again, math, frac, and guess what? There's your fraction of this. Really, really powerful way to figure out some pretty numbers on your vertex.